No worries, though. You know, to each their own. Turnstile. Okay, I, I want to do the turnstile because I've seen that in my comment section a lot a uh, couple of weeks ago. All right, what should I do by turnstile? Turnstile have love connection. I'll just do I'll just do the the very first one that pops up. Maybe not the most representative of the band, but it's the most viewed one. It's called Turnstile Love Connection. So, um, yeah, they have the band name in the name of the song. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. It's quite recent. So, pop punk. Eh, pop punk can be fucking slapping sometimes. Oh, it's 11 minutes long? Well, I guess, I guess we're here for 11 minutes. This is like an EP. <laughs> Are we just listening to an EP? Okay, I mean, sure, I, I did this to myself. I can't really back out of it now. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's some energy to end the stream up. <laughs> This feels old school. Very old school. Yeah, probably. That sounds like a perfect soundtrack for that. Or perhaps like Need for Speed Most Wanted. Four songs. I guess we're doing four. <laughs> Sounds like a bit cleaner uh, rage on the vocals, rage against the shit. Like when he's uh, yelling, that is. It is pretty cool, it's a un very unexpected vibe from this. But anything old school is, is automatically like super enjoyable. To me personally, I don't know. Six hundred K monthly listeners. Okay, they're they're not exactly a small band then. <laughs> we just walked into a moderately popular band. Okay. The next big thing in hardcore. <laughs> Couldn't tell you. Wow. I actually like this part a lot. It was pumping. Yeah, this sounds like hardcore but happy. You know, happy hardcore. Yeah, pretty decent. I agree with you. I kind of expect more, but I think we're gonna get more. Like, this sounds very promising. Vocals remind you of Desertion if it was the 90s. Very interesting take. Okay, what's what's the next one? The next one's like an interlude. No surprise. Alright. Look around, there's windows over a mirror that you're looking at. We got some stylish music going on here. <laughs> didn't ex didn't expect that. Tiny house. And that is a very sweet interlude. I like it. Here's our next one. Mystery. It's our next song. The production is very punchy. I think that's what partially just makes me so uh, hyped about it. The production is very good. 
all the like all this stuff I love absolutely oh okay hmm That is so 2011. I agree with you. Oh. Damn. Twenty eleven cult. They want their songs back. Hello? <laughs> Who's this? Turns top? Pretty cringe bit, not gonna lie. <laughs> What was I thinking? <laughs> 35 minutes for 15 songs? Sounds like- sounds about hardcore. Well, this one doesn't catch me as much as the first one, I suppose. Ooh, love that. Love that. Happy as hardcore. Ooh. It's very childish, kind of youthful, not childish, youthful type of music. Yeah, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> Thanks, useless material. M mineral, sorry, that's your name. Ooh, we're speeding up. It's out of the frame. Never mind. Oh, <laughs> you got some <laughs> southern vibes up in this bitch, okay. We're going to the south. I love this. I absolutely love this. This is TLC. This is the title track. Yeah. The drumming is super fast. <laughs> Love it. Ooh. Love that. Damn, that is, that is Need for Speed. <laughs> that sounds like Need for Speed. Love it. Now it's like pop punk hardcore. Me too. I'm vibing to this as hell. The hardcore man doesn't listen to hardcore that much, surprisingly. <laughs> Yeah, pop, pop punk hardcore is the perfect name for the genre they're, they're playing. They ever give you upcore? Wish, wish I had it been in that genre. Would have been so sick. I think his vocals are very fitting. Like, they're not the most enjoyable to listen to outside of this genre, but like, super fitting for the, for the style they're going for. Is that all? Is that all for the CP? We have quite a lot more left, so maybe not. It is, a, it's like a late summer vibe. You know, just, just doing nothing. Enjoying life. You know, that kind of thing. Not having to, to do anything. Brings back the youthful uh, angst. 
Bro, I'm talking like I'm fucking 30. <laughs> I'm still youthful. Yeah. Yeah. You blast you 100% blasters in your car. I enjoyed this. I enjoyed this a lot more than I expected to. Like if this was some froggy metal core which I kind of expected it to be. I kind of like expect it cuz that's what usually gets recommended to me uh on on YouTube in the comments. So I'm like always expecting some kind of deathcore uh proggy type of shit. But this was a actually really pleasant surprise for me. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. It's a it's a switch. It's a bit of a change change of pace, you know. It's like it's nice. <laughs> the only thing I'll say, like I know this is the specificities of the genre. I wish the songs were a bit longer. I wish there was a bit more stuff happening in them, you know? You know, I, I, I really enjoyed that, uh, this turnstile music here. I'm going to add this to my playlist. So thank you to whoever uh, recommended this to me. This is a very pleasant listen. I think I'm going to head out, though, for this one. I think we've been here for quite a while. Yeah, bedtime. <laughs>